Libya's leader Muammar Gaddafi appears to be taking increasingly brutal measures to put down a popular uprising against his 41-year rule. These pictures, purportedly showing graves in Tripoli, emerged as Italy's foreign minister put the number of dead at up to a thousand already. A former army officer said the east of the country had already fallen to the rebellion. But a dissident Libyan diplomat said it was different in the west. They are attacking the people uh, in, in uh, all the cities in, uh, in uh, western Libya. Certainly the people have no armies. And I think the genocide started now in Libya. And I think the code uh, 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 was the, the, the Gaddafi, the Gaddafi uh, uh, statement. Many Libyan ambassadors, his own interior minister, according to one report, and a swathe of world leaders have rounded on Gaddafi for his desperately violent measures to retain power. Despite a clampdown on information, pictures have made it onto the internet, appearing to show the capital Tripoli paralyzed. But witnesses have reported gunfire. In his televised address yesterday, Gaddafi called on loyalists to take over the streets and catch the anti-government protesters. A small contingent did demonstrate their support for him, but his support is shrinking. It was a defiant Gaddafi who addressed his crumbling nation on TV, thumping the lectern and promising to die in Libya a martyr. But while he digs his heels in, governments around the world are scrambling to get their citizens out.